This is King Tiger V2, and this is the oldest surviving King Tiger in the world. And with your help, we're going to restore it to running condition. And it'll be the most ambitious project we have ever attempted. It's going to cost over a million pounds and take around four years to complete, but we'll keep you updated every step of the way. But before we ask for help, let's have a look at why this vehicle is so special. It was the second of 492 King Tigers to roll off the production line. That's why it's called V2. The V is short for Versux, the German word for trial. Built in December 1943, it would spend its entire service life at the Henschel testing facility. When this was overrun by Allied forces, V2 was found to be fully stowed and ready to fight, although we don't believe it ever fired a shot in anger. What makes V2 unique is it's the only surviving King Tiger with this pre-production turret. 50 of these were built by Krupp from abandoned Porsche tank design and were repurposed on the earliest King Tigers. Today, the vehicle is a shell. While some parts are in storage, others are missing. As you might expect, the biggest challenge will be the engine and the gearbox. Its original engine block survives, but not all of its components. And as for its gearbox, well, there isn't one, and we've had no record of it being here at all. At least we've got this, the steering wheel, which is a start, and it's our intention to complete the work as close to the original specification as possible. And this is going to be a fascinating and challenging project. The project will be led by our workshop team, supported by a range of carefully selected partners from across Europe. We'll use the project as a springboard for further research to develop new skills and train the next generation of heritage engineers using external experts to guide us where necessary. And we'll share our journey on our website, social media and YouTube channel. This is the project our supporters have requested the most in recent years. And with your support, we know we can do it. The restoration of King Tiger V2 will be entirely funded by public donations, so it doesn't interfere with the core work of the museum. But that means we need over a million pounds to complete it. It's a big target, but this is a big tank that will make a big impact on our audiences, both young and old. If you would be interested in helping us bring King Tiger V2 back to life, visit tankmuseum.org slash ktv2 and subscribe to our e-newsletter or social media for the latest on our progress. Thank you.